spring and the desert is carpeted with flowers. This is a super bloom, the biggest, most exuberant wildflower show in years. But where do these super blooms come from? Where are these plants the rest of the time? And why are the blooms so rare? Researchers at the Desert Lab here on Tumamak Hill, led by Larry Venable, have been studying annual plants for decades to decode their mysterious ways. Remarkably, about half of the plant species in the Sonoran Desert are annuals, which means that an individual plant germinates, flowers, fruits, and dies all in under a year. With hundreds of species, wouldn't these plants be more obvious? The remarkable thing about these plants is that the majority of their existence is spent as a seed, lying just below the surface of the ground, waiting for the right moment to spring to life. Lying dormant as a seed and only emerging briefly at the right time for root production is a sophisticated endeavor that plants evolved to survive through with difficult circumstances. The desert is harsh, variable, and largely unpredictable. Some years can have almost no rain, while others are extremely wet. The rain that does fall is broken up by dry periods of varying length. Long-term research at Tumamak Hill has revealed that in response to such variability, annual species have developed a wide range of life strategies. For example, annuals destined to flower in March, winter annuals, must germinate in late fall to avoid the seed-killing heat of summer. In fact, these seeds are unable to germinate without first experiencing a long exposure to high temperatures, causing them to wait until the summer monsoon has passed. Another fascinating way these species have evolved to handle the extremes of desert life is to hedge their bets. The saying, don't put all your eggs in one basket, applies to plants too. Instead of all the seeds germinating after a single rain event, some seeds resist germination. It is very possible that they have missed their chance and will never have another. Yet, if that rainfall is followed by weeks of sun and heat, the seedling will wither and die. By waiting, some seeds have another chance at life. Betting on the variability of the desert rather than going for broke is yet another ticket success for desert annual plants. Fully half of the plant species in the Sonoran Desert lie hidden in the soil for most of the year, each with its own strategy, patiently waiting for the right moment to come alive and fill the desert with color.